welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be doing this bride of frankenstein look i have been waiting to do this i've tried to film it a couple times but i think i finally got it right it uses some special effects makeup and some glam makeup so let's get started before we put any sort of foundation on i just put a little primer in my t-zone i'm gonna take copenhagen pencil from nyx and i'm gonna come around my face very lightly and draw where I want the scar to be. So this is where our stitches are going to land. And I'm just using this pencil to draw it out because we're going to put the scarring liquid over top and this is going to kind of give it a fresher, kind of gorier look. So I'm not doing anything on this side. So we're done with that. Now I'm taking the Rigid Collodion. This is from Miron. And we're going to do our first layer. This is going to take multiple layers. Uh, so I'm going to fast forward through it. But you just use the applicator on here. I'm just going to start brushing it on. And you'll start feeling it pull on your skin as soon as it does it. So I'm going to let that dry. And it's actually like crackling. It's really weird. As it's drying, I'm going to do my eyebrows. So I'm going to brush my brows first just to see what kind of shape they are in. And we're just going to fill them in. This is the Goof Poof pencil in number five. I'm going to start doing my foundation, which is just going to be this really fair concealer from Physicians Formula on a sponge uh, while this is still kind of pulling, and then we will put on the second layer, so I'm just not going to put anything in this area. So now while I am letting layers like three and four dry, I'm going to prime my lids like usual with my NYX base all over the lids and just get ready to do my eyes. Bedrock, the uh, kind of slaty gray color. I'm going to put this in my crease with an angled fluffy brush. I'm going to press Rockstar, which is a duochrome eyeshadow. It's kind of grayish and white onto my eyelid.
now I have about like probably eight to ten layers of the scarring liquid and it's still setting up so I am going to throw on some liquid liner and some lashes and then I will be right back and we'll see where we're at um, if I'm able to cover it up yet or not or if we're going to do more with the eyes. Okay, so this has gotten fairly deep now and I don't want to put too much of it on my face. So I am just going to fill in the rest of my face with the concealer. I'm just going to use a little bit just so that the you don't really see the edges of the Rigid Collodion. And it just all kind of blends together. And that also dulls the redness so it's not so like purpley red like it was before it just looks kind of like a old cut or scar so now we're just gonna give the eyes a break uh just because i have the basically everything on that i need um for the moment so we're gonna start putting the stitches on now i have tweezers here to put them on with and i am using black twist ties and I'm just going to put some lash glue on them. It's the Velour Lash Glue. And I'm going to stick them on kind of in a stapled like or stitch pattern on my face. Uh, so I'm just going to speed that up. Watch some YouTube while I do it. Uh, and you guys can watch. So now I'm just going to let these kind of dry and stay in place. Um, I am going to put a few probably down on my neck here, but we will see. Uh, so I am going to smudge a little bit of this dark green I have from MBA Cosmetics. This is Soldier, and I'm just putting this on a liner brush. In the inner corner, I'm just going to take my finger with a little bit of Shimmer Shimmer from Makeup Geek. It's a foil shadow. And pop this in the inner corner. Just for a little bit of highlight. And I'm also going to put some right underneath my brow. I'm going to contour using the Wet n Wild Mega Glow. I added some neck details just to kind of tie into the look. Um, this stuff makes your neck feel really, really tight and almost like it's kind of strangling you. Uh, so if you have like issues with that feeling, uh, don't do this, but I kind of feel like I'm being choked. Uh, it doesn't really bother me, but it's just, it's not comfortable either. Uh, so for the lips, I'm going to use Dirty Money from Jeffree Star. And then I will be putting on a wig and we'll see the completed look. Okay, so this is the completed makeup look. I'm gonna go put on my costume and my wig and I will see you guys back here. Thanks for putting up with my crap. No problem. And I love you. Love you too. <laughs> <laughs>